How are we going everybody? I'm about to sow some autumn winter seeds. I'm going to do some lettuce because we run out of lettuce. I've got here out of our, uh, what is this actually? A 10 pack. It's an autumn winter collection. I've got some lettuce, cos summer, iceberg summer. I'm actually going to put all year round cauliflowers and broccoli and bistro blend lettuce. Now, I'm going to sow it in my little tray. This is from the uh, mini hothouse kit that we have. This is the base. It hasn't got any holes, but I'm not putting uh, seed raising mix. I'm actually going to use the coconut koi or coconut pith. And this is the stuff that we've got now available loose. It's got larger piece, pieces in it as well. So this is almost like, what I like about the larger pieces is because the uh, the coconut koi is so fine, it does dry out quite quickly, even though it absorbs, you know, 10,000 times its own weight, it dehydrates real quick. And having the larger pieces, it's almost like Hugel culture, culture where the bigger piece of wood starts to absorb you know, and that's not a big piece, but by comparison to the koya, it is. That'll absorb the moisture. You see how they're moist? You can see the darkness in them. So they, they hold moisture, and as the coconut koya starts to dehydrate, they start to release their moisture back into here. So it keeps the moisture in all that little bit longer, which is great. Now, that's all I'm putting in here. That's as far as the growing medium, but I am going to hand actually add in a small handful of black oh sorry it's not actually black grid is it it's super food with black grid in it it's only because i can see the black grid so i'm going to sprinkle that over the top and just sort of massage that through it's not the perfect science in the way that i'm massaging it but look it's in there and the, all i'm trying to do is activate so activate some microbial activity in here it's not going to be the most active environment but it's certainly going to make a huge difference and we also are going to feed it with liquid gold so we can just stimulate the microbial activity in there so what are we putting here it also comes with labels folks so we're putting five we'll do one two three four five and i'm doing it like this so i can do two rows now you can use your seeding tool here mini seeder which i'll do one example of this is what i'll do and the rest i suppose i'll just do by hand if i can get this lid off there we are now there's a hundred seeds in here, so you don't want a hundred lettuces, I suppose, but well, that's probably about 20 or so. That'll keep me going. Put the lid on, it's, it's got a calibration opening on it, so we're going with the small, medium, large. Just go by the size of your seed. I'm gonna go medium, it's gonna be a little bit quick to move. And here we go. Oop. And we just tap along. Okay, now make sure we put the name on, Bistro. Bistro lettuce goes there. Oh, the date as well. What is the date? Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Or was that yesterday? <laughs> Feb. There we are. Do the same for the next four. And then just give it a good water with our liquid gold. This has got a bit of a leak in it. Now, folks, I haven't pressed the seeds in at all. I'm just going to let them sink in with the water because it'll compact it. And just to make sure it's well hydrated, pick it up to feel the weight difference. If you see any seeds popping out, just gently push, push them in like that. Don't need to put the lid on, keep it in a nice warm spot. Plenty of sunlight, but protect it from the afternoon and make sure it doesn't get too much wind. I'm gonna take it inside there under the netting, under some tomatoes there, and they'll get a water every time I water the tomatoes. And before you realize, these will be popping up and ready to be transplanted into the garden for autumn winter pickings. You can get this on our website, vasilisgarden.com. It's called the Mini Hot House Autumn Starters Kit. Plenty of great goodies in there for you to get yourself some beautiful veggies growing this autumn winter. Check it all out, vasilisgarden.com. From Eva Silly, Maresi.